topic my karachi by mohammad mudassir the weather was so pleasant and it became more vivid with the sound of music playing in the car our car was going towards clifton while we made plans for shopping and dinner as well karachi is becoming a place where you can find shopping malls food courts coffee shops and a food street like port grant it is only one side of karachi which shows peace wealth and a fast paced life when the car neared the traffic signal instead of slowing down faisal looked around and drove the car recklessly through the red light a person who was crossing the road fortunately just escaped being hit by the car faisal i shouted are you crazy faisal replied with a smiling face come on amir this is normal and everyone does this I thought in Pakistan nobody wants to fulfill their responsibilities. We always blame the system. Perhaps we have learned this attitude since childhood. We have so many excuses like no one follows the rules so why should we? And if the same people go to Europe or any other country they follow all the rules there. We reached park towers. I looked around there was a long queue of cars. and everyone was enjoying themselves in a different environment and no one looking at this scene could say that this was a part of a poor country hi sara sorry you had to wait for me fasal said to the friend who was waiting for him in the food court we were engaged in talking about future plans and the less than bright and in fact dark future of pakistan while we ate italian food i love europe I will study there for a master's degree she said I asked her if she had been Europe she said no I thought it's a social problem how we want to show our social status and rule over others because it is symbol of pride in the family if someone in that family is living is abroad or has a foreign nationality Sarah had to leave early because there was trouble in the city. Karachi is an unpredictable place. It can be shut down and brought to a halt within 10 minutes only by spreading rumors of trouble. Unfortunately, it has been divided by different religious and political sects. The business environment, social life and students' minds are affected significantly. But people now have become so used to this that the very next day after serious trouble in the city Life in Karachi becomes normal as though nothing had been happened the day before we drove through the sea view at night sea view is a breathtaking place because it has a calm environment when we were returning home after crossing the three sorts roundabout i noticed a social welfare trust which was situated at the corner there which helps poor people selflessly on a daily basis this too is another faces of karachi just after crossing bridge at nursery we saw a crowd an old man lay on the road because he was injured but we didn't stop and help we moved on even though we saw him in need of help next morning i read in the newspaper that a person died before reaching the hospital because he was badly injured in an accident If he could have reached the hospital 10 minutes earlier his life would have been saved. I threw the newspaper down and did not give this a second thought and went off to college. I engaged in my routine of life of studies, socializing, sharing thoughts of economic development etc. Nobody here has enough time to think about the true realities of society because everyone has their own interests. I too do not think because I am part of this society. and it is a normal thing in our life